It is Monday late afternoon. I'm starting the vlog here because I have my first ED night shift tomorrow. So I thought it would be fun to bring you guys along with me. The plan is to try and rejig my sleep schedule just so that I can survive the whole night. So going to try and stay up until 4am and then wake up at around 2 to 3pm and head out for 9pm. Um, obviously I will be taking breaks, like I'm only a med student, so it's all for the experience. But having said that, I do want to make the most out of it because I am literally spending the night in ED when I could be at home in bed. But yeah, I am going to make myself a coffee, which I usually don't do at this time because coffee does affect me. So I usually have one in the morning and if I really, really need one, I'll have one around like one to two latest three. I'll have dinner, maybe go to the gym because I really do want to go but also I don't want to tie myself out too much so I'll see how I feel and I want to try and get some studying done and if I really need some extra help in terms of trying to stay awake I'll probably like watch a movie or something, nothing too, too hectic but yeah I'm just gonna make just want to show this very cute blue cup from Hay. It's actually my flatmates, um, but because we, you know, use our cups together and everything, I'm just going to be having my coffee in here. Um, but yeah, I showed it in my story recently and I think it's very cute.
sent me a box of their products. So going to unbox this with you guys. Here we have some of Tuagain's masks. I'm really excited to use these because I tried their rice face mask before and really like it. Um, oh, wait. So this is a one that I've tried. White rice wash off mask. We seem to have two more here. So we've got a pumpkin wash off mask and a mung bean wash off mask. This one seems to be like a clay consistency, so similar to this one here. Um, but this one seems to be more gel-like. I don't know, maybe I should use this now. Just because it's around three, but I could chill and relax a bit with this, which would be nice. Seems like we have the toner here and the powder wash. So I believe this is so it's in powder form as you can see, but you can add some to your hand, add some water, make it into a paste and use that to wash your face off. So it's basically like a cleanser. This is their Rice brand sunscreen, their facial moisturiser and their overnight mask. So it seems like it's a set of four with the sunscreen. But I think I really want to use this face mask here now, which is the pumpkin wash off mask. So yeah. You can really tell they use fresh ingredients because they smell so good. Like the rice brown one. If you know, there's this Korean sweet rice brown drink called Latin Hesso and it basically smells exactly like that. Um, but this one, because it's a sweet pumpkin one, it reminds me of Hobak Juk, which I love and I love how it feels so smooth. Yeah. So you're going to leave this in for around 15 minutes and then wash it off. I'm just about to head out, but I'm going to make myself an espresso matcha latte um, just for a caffeine kick, and then I'm gonna head out. I'll just try and center it a bit better. Yeah, I'm looking for my sight. <laughs> <laughs> You feel like you need to treat yourself like. All the effort, I think I'll be
actually going to be watching The Lion King the musical with Pathusha. She bought me tickets for a little early birthday treat so I'm really excited because I actually have seen The Lion King when I was around four years old but I remember it so vividly. Super excited to see it again as an adult. Today I didn't really do much. I came back home, did the online short best answer question thing that I have to do and was in bed most of the time basically. Going to be taking this with me. So in here I have hand sanitizer, my eye drops because I have really dry eyes, Vaseline and also this new lip that I've been using these days. These are like trending right now but this one's in the colour CJ026 but packaging colour so so good so highly recommend this and in this little pouch i've got this mini non-fiction open arms perfume Okay, Gillian, don't break up the phone! <laughs> <laughs> 